To limit global warming, fast and substantial reductions of CO2 are required. CO2 is the main driver of climate change, but it's not the only one. Short-lived climate pollutants have a much shorter lifetime in the atmosphere than CO2. Reducing emissions will slow down the rate of global warming, improve local air quality and health, and prevent damage to food crops. It's a challenge around the world, but policy measures must be adopted to local and national circumstances. In Norway, diesel engines and burning wood for heating are the main sources of small particles that contain black carbon, often called soot. Norway is close to the Arctic. Black carbon is carried by the winds, falls on snow and ice, increasing melting and global warming. Only modern, clean burning wood stoves are sold in Norway. In several municipalities, limited public grants have boosted replacement of older stoves. Experiencing personal advantages has been a key to success. Lower taxes, smaller fuel bills, faster commuting and other benefits have made electric vehicles popular in Norway. Hydrofluorocarbons are man-made gases, mostly used in air conditioning and refrigeration. They have replaced gases that damaged the ozone layer, but they have a strong warming effect. Norway has a tax and refund scheme to collect and safely destroy these gases. The tax system also encourages use of climate-friendly alternatives. Methane warms the atmosphere. It also contributes to the formation of ozone near the ground, which is harmful to health and crops. Organic waste is a common source of methane. In Norway, it is illegal to landfill organic waste. This reduces emissions and creates new opportunities, such as producing biogas to replace diesel. This requires planning and infrastructure, but the investments can pay off. Norway has implemented a range of measures reducing emissions of short-lived climate pollutants. Recently, Norway made a coherent knowledge platform for policy measures covering most sectors of society. Norway also analyzed how national greenhouse gas measures will affect emissions of short-lived climate pollutants. Norway is happy to share its experiences with you.